Remote Assist Mobile is now available on mobile devices without augmented reality support today. We are expanding devices Remote Assist Mobile is available on so that technicians can still conduct repairs and inspections with remote help. Hence, if your mobile device does not support Air Core or Air Kit, don't worry, you can still use Remote Assist Mobile. So let's walk through the experience together. After you successfully sign into Remote Assist Mobile with your credentials, you will be shown the screen which notifies you that you are using a mobile device without augmented reality support. Unfortunately, you won't get the full augmented reality experience, but we assure you that you can still collaborate and connect with the remote collaborator. This notification also allows you to select the Learn More link, and it will take you to the Remote Assist Guided Documentation on how this app works on devices without augmented reality support. You can dismiss this notification screen and call a remote collaborator by either searching for the name or selecting the name in the recent contacts list. In this example, we are selecting the remote collaborator from the recent contact list. Now launch a call with the remote collaborator and both of you will enter into a video call. Now you will be sharing your space with the remote collaborator on Remote Assist Mobile, Teams Desktop, or Teams Mobile when the remote collaborator answers the call. In this example, we will be showing you the remote collaborator on Teams Desktop. During this call, you will notice that you can't place mixed reality annotations on the shared environment. This is a limitation from using a non-AR capable device. However, you can place 2D annotations when the technician takes a snapshot of the environment. Select the snapshot icon now and both the technician and remote collaborator can add 2D annotations on the frozen frame. This allows the technician to still receive guidance for this repair. After this, the technician can select the check mark to exit out of snapshot mode and either discard or save the snapshot to the local device's photo gallery or remote assist text chat. In this example, we are saving it to the text chat. After the repair is finished with remote help, the technician can end the call. Since the technician is a Dynamics 365 field service customer, this technician can select whether or not to post a call history and snapshot to an associated work order. In this example, the technician chose not to.